Today's video is brought to you by Squarespace. Whenever I talk about gear, gear on this channel, I feel like I'm usually talking about things that are, that are either hundreds or thousands of dollars. But today I have put together a list of 10 things that are under $25 that if you are a photographer, a filmmaker, a creator of any kind, these are gonna make your life better, easier. Essentially these are 10 things that just make my life easier as a creator. And all 10 of them are under $25. You can find them all on Amazon, links in the description below. There are, there's three things that are not under $25, but we'll make those bonus items. So technically there's 13 things today and 10 of them are under 25 bucks. Should we start, should we start lowest to highest or highest to, let's go most expensive to cheapest and we will start at $25 for rechargeable batteries. And not just any rechargeable batteries, but rechargeable batteries that, that are incredibly clever. Because on the back side right here, they have a USB-C port right on the battery. Usually when you have rechargeable batteries, you need like a, a charging brick or something to put them in to charge them up. But these just come with this little, this little multi-cable here, which is USB a on one side and then it has four USB-C's on the other side, which is convenient because there's four batteries that come with it. A super clever bit on these batteries also is that, look, they have charging lights on the batteries. At number one, rechargeable batteries, both AAA and AA. Um, yeah, just makes my life easier. Down to $22 and, and something that, that again, I just, I have it in like five different bags now, but it is this guy. This is a universal cable that is USB-A on one side and that is all three things on the other side. So it's micro USB. And then if I put this cap on there, it becomes USB-C. And if I put this cap on there, it becomes lightning. So one cable that I can keep in my bag, I keep one in my van, I keep one in like multiple camera bags. So if I'm ever out and I need to charge something up, I always have the right cable. Okay, next up at $21 is, is this guy. This I use, I use every single day. This is the camera multi-tool from Small Rig, and it's it's basically just a, a Leatherman tool, but for, for cameras. On one side, you have three different sized Allen keys. On the other side, you have a, a fourth Allen key, a screwdriver, like a flathead for, for camera plates, and then you've got a Phillips head, and you even have a star bit for certain, certain tripods have those like star bit legs on them. And yeah, this thing, this thing just lives with me. And again, I have like four of these. This is in my, my tech pouch, it's in my camera bag. I have one in the van, and I think I have one on my desk somewhere. You can never have too many multi-tools. Next up at $17, which does sound steep for this item, but it is an invaluable piece of gear that you will use all the time. And then I talk about it a lot on this channel, and that is gaff tape. You must have gaff tape in your life. If you don't have gaff tape in your life, you're welcome for $17. Life's about to change, not, not change, but I keep a whole bunch of gaff tape on me and this is like half my stash, but I have multiple colors so I can label things. I, I label all sorts of things, like I just use them as labels themselves, but also you can mark things. Maybe you're gonna put a tripod on the ground for your YouTube setup. On the base of my tripod at the bottom, there's three pieces of tape. So if my tripod moves, if I bump into it, I know I just put the tripod right back on those three spots and I am, I'm back to this shot. I have my shot back. In at number five, and saying that this is $12.99 is, is actually a bit misleading, but you know how normally we get these like little lens cloths like this, like they come in and maybe you bought a filter and it came with a lens. You, we just, you end up with a bunch of these. Like I've got a thousand of these little lens cloths everywhere and they're, they're terrible. Having a tiny lens cloth is not what you want. What you want is a big old lens cloth, like a, a honker. I think this is like a nine by nine, but I just I just ordered the ones that I'm linking to you guys and they're 12 by 12 and there's 12 of them. So for $12.99, you are gonna get 12, 12 by 12 lens cloths that you can just stuff into your bag and at any point you reach in there, you get it out. You're like, you need like a cloth. Like you want like, you don't want to take this this little stupid thing and, and be like, mm, let me clean my lens. That's silly, get a big cloth really wipe that thing down, like get in there. This is just a, just a good cloth. Okay, five down, five to go. 
let me take one minute real quick to thank the sponsor of today's video, Squarespace. If somehow you don't already know about Squarespace, Squarespace is your all-in-one website building platform that I have used for my photography business for the last 10 years. And it's been amazing, so amazing that I'm now building a new website for this channel on Squarespace and I'm using something called their new Fluid Engine and it is like broken my brain. Squarespace's design process has always been super simple, very drag and drop based. Like if you know how to open files on your computer, find images, put them in there, uh, you know how to build a Squarespace website. But now you can take one of their professionally designed templates and using their new Fluid Engine system, you can move things pretty much infinitely customizable because it's all grid-based now. Where the classic version of Squarespace was more block-based where you kind of moved blocks into place and you could, you could really customize it quite a bit, but not not as much as you can now. And possibly the coolest thing about the new Fluid Engine system is that I can make my website look differently when you go to it from your mobile device than when you go to it from your desktop device. And I, I am having fun designing my new website. If you want to check out Squarespace's new Fluid Engine design system, shoot to the first thing in the description, go over to Squarespace and sign up for a totally free trial. With that free trial, you can download one of their professional templates, start building out your website, play with that, that Fluid Engine system and just be blown away at how simple it is. And then when you're ready to go live, use code David Manning for 10% off at checkout. Thank you again, Squarespace. Okay, let's speed this up a little bit. The next item at number six is my, my label maker. It's an embossing label maker, and I love the labels that come out of this thing. And while, while all label makers are quite fun, this one's, it's like a specially satisfying to use. This is like that old school kind of label that's actually raised a little bit. It's an embossing label maker. So it's, so it's not just printing the label out, it's actually embossing it through through the tape. So you end up with these, these like really cool, these really cool labels that, I don't know, they have like a nostalgic feel to them. And now I spent, $40 on this one. This is the Dymo 1540, but I mentioned this in an older video and someone was like, dude, you can get those for like 12 bucks now. In at the number seven slot is something that I use literally every day and it's a rocket blower. I have seen other creators talk about there's a, there's a motorized version where like you flip a switch and it's like and it blows air like a rocket blower, but this is the same one that I've had for like 14, maybe 15 years. And while this one, this is the Giotto's version I got from B&H like way back in the day, the ones on Amazon for nine bucks are the exact same rocket blower that will probably last you 12 years for nine bucks. At number eight on my list is, is something that I spent way too much money for. This is a color checker passport and it, it has all sorts of colors in there and this is incredibly useful for photographers. But what I use this most for is is that right there. And this is to help me set my white balance. So when I run a shot like this, right before I start filming, I just hold this thing up real quick. I go back and forth a couple of times. And now in post, if my white balance is off a little bit or I'm looking at the shot, I'm like, that looks weird. I go to this reference image, I click on my little white balance dropper and I go, blip, and I click on that. Boom, I have my white balance set to whatever lighting conditions I was shooting in. Now I said I spent too much on these because this, this bit right here, this little like passport checker with a plastic case and everything is $110, but they they sell the exact same thing on Amazon for $9. It's essentially just a gray card set, just the just the card itself. So just holding that card up, you you can set your white balance on any shoot very easily. And you don't have to spend $110 for this damn thing. In at number nine is a, a, a little dual use or, or using something that's designed for something else but for photography. And it's these guys, these little brushes right here are incredibly useful for cleaning gear. And I think they are $8 for 10 of them and they're they're designed for cleaning guns, but that's that's kind of the beauty of them is that they're kind of perfectly designed to get down in grooves and be able to like really reach in there and brush things out. Now don't use this like directly on your lens, but all the different little like gear spots on there on top of your camera, you know like where all your your dials are, there gets gunk up in, just use this brush and it gets it right out. And in at number 10 on the list and I think it's $6 for four of them is a black Sharpie, but then wrapped in gaff tape. So maybe, maybe more. And I make a bunch of these and I keep these in, in different camera bags, but all it is is a black Sharpie, which I use all the time. And then wrapped around that is white gaff tape, 
black gaff tape, and then medical tape. Now the medical tape is for when, when a clip on a lav, like you can't clip it to, to somebody, so you wanna tape it to them, and you don't have like the lav sticky bits. You just use a little piece of medical tape and you can tape it underneath their shirt, hide it with their shirt, and boom, lav is mounted because you had a little bit of medical tape in your bag wrapped around a Sharpie. And that is the 10 things that are under $25. But like I said, there's there's three kind of bonus items here that, yeah, I just think like photo, they, it makes this list, they're under a hundred bucks, that makes you feel better. And the first one is under $50 and it is it is this guy right here. And this is this is like an insane deal on Amazon, but this is from First Power, it is a dual charger for Sony's FZ100 battery. So if you're shooting any of the a7 series cameras, it takes these FZ batteries, and this is a dual charger that just makes life so much easier, and it's so much smaller than like the Sony single charger that you get when you buy the camera. I like them so much, I actually bought two sets of them so that I can charge four batteries at once and, and really make my life even that much easier. The second bonus item is also a, a dual of sorts, and this is a dual SD card reader. So I use I use this guy mainly because a lot of times I'll go out, I'll film multiple cameras, I come back and I've got four SD cards that I need to import into my computer and importing them one by one, just like charging batteries, it's kind of a pain in the butt. It's like these simple things that, that we pick up as creators that honestly, like this makes life so much better. The whole process of making these videos it makes it, uh, it makes it twice as fast, or at least uh, the import process twice as fast. Okay, the very last thing on my list, and technically, while this is $88, you do get four of them, uh, and they're air tags. I, I really don't know what I would do with all this photo gear now without air tags. I use them for, for every single bag has these air tags in them. If you didn't watch my video on how to make them ninja air tags by removing the speaker, click up there, go watch that video. You can see how to take an air tag, take the speaker out so someone steals your bag and then they get the little thing. They can't find your air tag and you have time to go find them before, before they ditch your air tag. Okay, and that is 10 things under $25, three things that were not under $25, but again, all of these things just make my life so much easier. Batteries that are on USB-C, gaff tape, a rocket blower, a label maker, a small rig tool that I got a bunch of, dual chargers, dual SD card readers, gray cards. This is like the stuff that, that actually makes my life as a creator better. Like I can get new lenses or new cameras. That's all very exciting stuff to talk about, but this is the stuff I don't know. Sometimes it's the little things that, that matter. Okay, I hope this video was helpful for you guys, and I hope you found something on this list that, that yeah, changes how you do your work. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you soon. You wanna come say hi? Come here. Zoe, come here. Look who came to say hello today. Zoe, say hi. Say, oh. Can you, are you not even, hey, look at the lens. No? You just wanna go outside? You want outside? You want a treat? Oh, you want a treat? Are you wagging your tail? You wagging, let's go get a treat. Can you reach up here? Try to reach up here. This is too high, huh? Oh, there you go. Up. Oh, <laughs> good girl. Oh. Say hello, everybody. Oh, what are you sneaking? Oh. Oh, you sneaky dicky. <laughs> Here you go. Ah! Good girl, baby. Good girl.